Hey, how you guys doing? I uh, want to tell you about a couple of things first before I go to the main topic. And um, I've been a little bit busy recently, so I haven't been able to do as many videos as I like. So I'm slightly behind. Uh, my father-in-law passed away um, about a week ago, so we just had the funeral yesterday. So that kind of slowed me down. He was a great guy, by the way, and he was also in the computer computers and com uh, computer communication uh, along those lines as well. Uh, also, of course, uh, Apple just announced their new Mac lineup today, uh, the 30th October 2018. So um, we're going to be doing update video for that. So on to the main topic at hand, which is Blackmagic has announced an update to their eGPU line, which is called their, of course, eGPU Pro. Um, now, of course, they their original first generation eGPU, which was the uh, utilizing the Radeon Pro 580 at a price point around $700. And so we're going to kind of run down a little bit this of the uh, eGPU, uh, eGPU Pro, some of their specs and graphic cards. Now, this does come at a higher price point of uh, $1,199 and uh, utilizes a newer uh, graphic card, which is the Radeon Vega 56, uh, eight gigabytes of VRAM. Now this is utilizing the newer VRAM, which is the HBM2, rather than the um, older DDR5, which we're normally used to seeing in a lot of the uh, older VRAM cards. Um, four USB 3 ports, uh, dis display port 1.4, two Thunderbolt 3 ports, HDMI 2.0, and a 85-watt uh, power supply. Now, really not as much change with the, um, it looks like, with the eGPU Pro, as far as the appliance itself. Um, of course, the only thing using this appliance, it is not upgradable, and the reason why they're coming out with the eGPU Pro, obviously. Um, the only really difference is it's utilizing a newer graphics card. Um, I would like to see perhaps uh, adding some new features besides just an upgraded graphics card in and of itself, but it's still probably a welcomed upgrade. Now, as I just uh, mentioned today, the uh, Apple came out with some new Macs. So um, they do have a new MacBook line that does utilize the uh, Vega GPUs. So this may not be an upgrade um, that you should be thinking about because it already has the uh, newest a uh, newer um, Vega GPUs. Um, however, if you have an older Mac or even um, PC that utilizes Thunderbolt 3, this might be a worthy upgrade. Um, as long as you have obviously a Thunderbolt 3. So, um, uh, I definitely want to tell you about this new upgrade from Blackmagic Design. Thanks uh, for watching and see you guys later.